Naglilipa na ang beauty hack sa internet and say na mapa YouTube, Instagram, and now it's all over TikTok. As in, hindi naman bago kasi beauty hacks eh, di ba? Ang dami natin nakikita talaga. Pero ngayon, parang mas creative siya. Tapos parang mas todo bigay, mas kung ano-anong ginagawa. We never know kasi I've never actually tried a beauty hack. I, I do have my own hacks na hindi, alam mo yun, hindi masyadong mm, rare. But I want to try, finally, for the first time in my beauty career, I want to try these beauty hacks from the internet and try a full face look. So we're gonna browse for internet hacks and I'm currently using the new Huawei Mate Pad 11. And I started listing the makeup steps and then I searched for a popular hack for each. I also thought na mas madali on TikTok so I did some browsing in there as well. Um, and I have to say there was a lot and medyo overwhelming siya sa akin. So I just looked for the most liked videos para madali. And then lastly, I just took notes of the final order, yung pagkakasunod-sunod ng makeup and it's makeup time. Itong first hack na to, this is the viral blush hack. This is from Vic Victoria Lin uh, from TikTok. And basically, yung hack niya, um, so she applied this red lipstick all over her cheekbones, tapos forehead, and specifically, it's a red lipstick, so medyo bold. And I feel like ang goal nito is para from within yung blush. Red lipstick present. And then on the other side, and then here, here, and there's a nose. I feel like kasi yung concept nito is, hindi, yeah, hindi pala correction eh, no? Kasi, ano pala yun eh, no? Dapat peach corrector yun. <laughs> hindi pantay! Hindi pantay yung mas mababa. Oh my gosh! Para ako nagkulot ng buhok, tapos nauna yung plancho sa mukha ko kaysa sa buhok ko. Ganun yung parang ano niya, itsura niya. Okay na po, thank you so much for watching. Next hack galing YouTube from It's My Ray Ray. And ang title niya is Applying Powder Before Foundation. Is it a hack or a whack? This has been, you know, ongoing for a while. Pero ngayon yata, parang medyo naiba siya from one TikTok na panood ko na a powder and then setting spray instead na directly foundation. Unahin ko siya sa forehead. So, set with powder. It's actually good. Para ako nag-correct, basically. Mas okay na mag-set ng powder dito. Like, I prefer that step kasi kung hindi, hahawa lang talaga yung foundation sa ano mo, sa red lipstick mo. <laughs> good luck sa napaka-orange mong foundation. Okay, and then next is the setting uh, spray. Wow! Wow! Para akong dinuraan ng setting spray. Ano yun? Ano ba nangyari dito? Wait lang. <laughs> Ayun sila. Meron pong technical problem ang ating setting spray. Para po siyang... <clears throat> and then, we'll just let it rest or let it set for a few seconds. As in, medyo... Alam mo yun, hindi siya totally wet kasi pwede hindi kumapit yung foundation. I am using a very fluid uh, liquid foundation para hindi niya matakpan yung, yung red lipstick underneath. Parang dapat hindi ka dito mag-overblend eh. Once mag-overblend ka, Kukunin mo lang lahat ng kulay sa red lipstick. Pero mas nakikita ko yung pula ng ilong ko. Yung talagang isang linya lang siyang ganun. Namumula lang siya. Ito po ang, ang ating achievement after five hours of blending. It's actually not bad. Nakikita ko talaga yung blush from within. But, gosh, yung blending time lang. So next is another blending technique. And this is this hack. Now, one liner contour. This is from Glamzilla ng TikTok. And she basically grabbed this bronzer, liquid bronzer. Liquid bronzer. Liquid bronzer. Tapos, gumamit siya ng flat foundation brush. Tapos, merong like fluid one liner form. Wala kasi ako masyadong like overly fluid na bronzer or contour. So, I'm going to mix a dark concealer doon sa foundation ko kanina. From here. To here, to... Oh my God! ta -da! Not bad! Promising siya! I like it! Ang maganda sa fluid na contour, ang dali niya i-blend. 
Ngayon ko nakikita, kakulay ng mukha ko yung t-shirt ko, yung sweatshirt ko. Sa totoo lang. Sabi ng ilong ko, we contour as one. Ginawa ko na yung aking kilay, tapos nag-set rin ako with powder. Hindi siya bad at all, actually. Pagdating sa blending, at pagdating sa, you know, parang dimension, hindi flat yung colors, which is nice. Except that talagang bilang pinagsasama-sama at pinag-join forces talaga natin yung lahat ng hacks in one. So, ayan. Kesa sa tumerno ang mukha ko sa leeg ko, parang hinhabol niya ang aking sweatshirt. Yung eye hack, galing din siya sa TikTok. And this is from uh, Tarte Cosmetics, actually. Hindi ko alam kung ito yung original, uh, pero nakita ko siya sa Tarte Cosmetics page. This is the eyeshadow hack for beginners. So I actually picked a very similar shade sa ginamit niya. I will begin sa lightest kasi once na mag-start kayo sa darkest, hahawa na yun. So... You'll start from the lightest to darkest. One. Sakto na shimmer stone. No? Siguro pareho kami ng palit na ginamit. Parang kailangan do. Sobrang kapalan mo yung color. Ooh. The hack talaga itself is gaganan mo lang, di ba? Tapos tsaka na siya, I mean, kung saan na siya mag-gradient. Fine, yun yung gagawin natin ngayon. Hmm, I think very wrong. Na nag-setting spray ako sa brush. I mean, nag-blend naman siya. Enjoying siya gawin, pero tricky din pala. I mean, mukha siyang sobrang dali, pero mas mahirap siya. And kailan nga talaga guys, huwag nga gaya yan, na nag-setting spray pa ako. It works! I mean, somehow nakita ko yung, you know, gradient niya. It looks mm, not the best, pero not bad at the same time. Ito para oh my god, na-stress ako. Para siyang detangling brush, tapos contour powder, tapos gaganon mo lang, and then may instant freckles ka. Ito yung tipo ng hack na parang, hmm, alam mong hindi mag-work, pero sige, sigupan natin, dahil interesado ko malamod ko totoo. So, ang ginawa is, ito yung detangling brush, malinis na siya, guys. I'll go for the darkest, para push na tayo, or actually, paghaluin ko na lang to. Ito, sinuklay-suklay na ganyan. Instant freckles, here we come. Ooh! Pantay-pantay. <laughs> Isang hilera yung freckles ko. But it actually works. Oh! Pero hindi maganda yung placement. Pero... It works. It... I am... Pleased. It's not bad at all. So, finally, puta tayo sa lips. And marami, as in, ito talaga yung nako, pick your, your weapon, puta tayo sa hacks, sa sobrang daming hacks, puta sa lips. This is from the account girls. And basically, naglagay ng Q-tip para daw perfect yung corners ng lips and also para hindi kumakapit yung lip color um, sa gitna. Lalagay natin siya dito. And then, kunin natin yung red lipstick kanina. Diretso yun, no? Hindi na nag-lip brush. Ah, naka-liquid lipstick. Saan ba dapat siya nakalagay dito? Di ba yun? Ah, para may sumasalo. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. I have so many questions. Basically, hindi na lagyan yung dito sa gilid. Tapos, I don't know, may space. So, baka ikaw connect ko na lang ito. Ah. So, ganun din. <laughs> Nag-lipstick din ako na mo. So, in short, for me, parang, Mas madaling gumanga at at i-trace. But actually, one tip na mabibigay ko is since ganito yung shape talaga ng lipstick natin, kaya siya ganito, it's because ito yung hugging sa labi. So, once na nandito na kayo sa end, sa corner part, you just have to tilt your lipstick sideways. Parang, one, two, three. And it's gonna hug your lips perfectly. 
And dito rin sa kabila. See? Tilt. And then, tilt. Nilagay ko siya talaga full blasted sa laptop at saka sa... So, in-extend ko lang yung, um, yung Matebook 14 dito sa Matepad 11. Kasi nagpo-photo siya pa ako minsan. Kapag nag edit gusto ko ng dalawang screen. Number one, hindi halatang halata yung pagka-orange niya. Kasi in person talaga, dahil talagang sobrang orange ng dating. Pero dito, kapag tinakpan naman yung leg, parang hindi na siya masyado manonotice. But flawless. Yung freckles, they are peeking through. Kita ito. Iba ang color ng face. Ibang-iba. Kesa dito na lighter. Medyo off yung shadow for me. I think I would just go the other way around. Madalas dito ako nag the darkest on the inner corner. And then sometimes hindi ako like kumaabot dito kasi sa eye shape ko, depende sa eye shape. Out of all the hacks, I think my favorite would be the contour. And also, what makes me happy. Hindi siya totally effective. I mean, medyo unhygienic, but it makes me happy and it surprised me na kahit pa paano meron siyang dinelivered. That would be the freckles. I enjoyed doing that. This is it, guys, for my final look for my full face of internet beauty hacks from YouTube and TikTok. Let me know kung meron pa kayong mga requests or kung meron kayong favorite internet hack, share it down below. For the links ng products, ilalagay ko on the description box below. Specifically, ito yung sa MatePad 11 natin. If you guys want to check uh, about it, no more details about it, I will be placing the link on the description box below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!